name is Veronica Fuerte. I'm the founder of Hey Studio in Barcelona. We have a visual language that we apply to everything from brands to individual pieces. In a small business, everyone has to do a bit of designing, but you don't need to be a professional to apply the basics of good design. Here are our top design tips for non-designers. Ooh, okay. Design is the face of your brand, and you might not realize it, but you are making design decisions all the time. The typeface you select, the color you use, even the way you format an email. All of these details affect how you present yourself and how you are perceived. Taking time to think about even small design details can give a big impact on your brand. For example, when we designed the branding for Arels, which means roots in Catalan, we made sure that every detail reflected the concept. We chose a serif typeface to express its organic warmth. We choose the color blue and red to represent the duality of the brand. Red because roots are from the nature, blue to express the urban style of the footwear. And we ripped the front page of the brand book to represent the imperfect beauty of nature. All of these small details make a big difference to how the brand is perceived. The more different concepts you try to show in one piece, the less people will understand your message. Non-designers often try to do too much with one design. But simplicity will not make your design feel boring or lacking. It's actually a key principle of good design. So it's better to focus on one idea and explore it as fully as possible. Rebel Japan was a project to raise awareness after the Japan earthquake in 2011. The bold red circle with the white shape represents the Japanese flag. The scattered elements express the revealed aspect. Simple. Design help us differentiate the importance of individual bits of information by size, shape, color, and typography. By generating contrast between elements, we can naturally draw people's eyes towards more important information. And by creating similarities between elements, we can show that concepts or bits of information are related. For the Life of Festival posters, the most famous artists have the biggest, boldest typography. So you always know they are the headliners. Other artists of similar status are grouped together and share the same color and size of the typography. Finally, the event details are black. This means you notice them last, as they are less important than the artist playing. When all the elements of your design complement each other, it has harmony. Harmony is a balance of color, texture, and contrast that is visually satisfying. If a design is not harmonious, it feels incoherent. One way to achieve harmony is by using the core color palette and making sure this fits with the surrounding elements. Harmony is an abstract concept with many ingredients, so it's easier to explain with an example. For the Fundación Joan Miró project, we choose colors from small elements in the paintings to use in the design, because this visually balances our work with the featured art pieces. The chessboard pattern also complements elements of the painting, which makes the whole poster feel harmonious. Color is one of the main pillars of design. It has its own universal language, so it's very important to take time and think about which ones to use and how many. Different colors inspire different emotions, so make sure the colors you choose transmit how you want people to feel. For the drink drinks, we pick colors that express the different feelings you experience from the flavors of each drink. Orange and fire for ginger, green and cool for cucumber and lime. His brand identity is positive, fun and fresh. We don't have any specific brand color, so we use a vibrant range of colors on our business cards to express this attitude. Business cards are normally the first experience people have on your brand, so choosing the right color is key. But don't be afraid to experiment with different combinations to express your personality. It's Design doesn't end when you finish the piece you are working on. It's a full story of four by many touch points. So it needs to be memorable and must fit with the rest of your project's identity. Always keep in mind whether the piece you are designing looks coherent with your company's other designs. If your designs are coherent and consistent over time, people will naturally be able to remember your brand or campaign when they see it. By repeating the same color, shapes, and typography, we built a memorable campaign identity for Barcelona Gallery Weekend. 
If people first see the poster, then a couple of days later, the frame has the tote bag, they will connect these two experiences and start to remember the campaign. Design makes a huge difference to people's perception of your brand. And I'm not just saying that because I'm a designer. Whether it's your website or your business card, design is probably the first thing your audience will experience of your company. So follow these basic principles the next time you design something and make that first interaction count. Yes, I show you a